welcome back to the channel. So today I have a Dollar Tree haul for you guys. If you are new here, thank you for tuning in. My name is Stephanie. It's so nice to have you. Um, I'm going to hurry and start this haul. It's kind of random. Uh, there's a lot of, I feel like there's a lot of stuff to show you. Um, so I'm going to get started. But the first thing that I want to start with is um, I picked up some more of these made with love jars. If you guys remember, I hauled these a while back um, when I first seen them at the Dollar Tree. And I picked these up along with these lace stickers because there is a subscriber who goes by Till Death Do Us Art. And you commented and you said that you wanted some of these lace stickers and also these glasses. Um, I know that you have found the glasses and I'm sorry that um, I wasn't quicker but if you are still interested I have these for you and I would love to send them to you um, so let me know if you are watching this comment below and I will make sure to get these out to you and also these lace stickers so just let me know um, okay so I'm gonna start with those now moving on um, I think I'm gonna start with the most I think most <laughs> I think I'm gonna start with the thing I was most excited about, and that is this Alice in Wonderland book. Now, if you watched my What's New at Dollar Tree, um, you would know that I found this, and I couldn't believe it. I was so excited. Um, I love Alice in Wonderland. I've always loved Alice in Wonderland. I hope that one day I can find the other book to this. Um, this one is Through the Looking Glass. And it is just amazing. It doesn't say how much it originally retailed for, but it is a Disney book, which I thought was really cool. So the other one is just the Alice in Wonderland, and then this one is Through the Looking Glass. So I'm hoping that one day I can find this book along with it. That would be amazing. Um, I was super excited to find this. I think it's well worth a dollar. Way nice to have in my book collection. So the next thing I want to show you guys is I just picked up some of these love signs. Um, now these are like the unfinished ones. Um, these are the paint yourself signs. And I figured that I could get two of them, one for one of my daughters and then one for the other for Brooklyn and Presley. And I could have them paint some love signs and we can either give them out as a Valentine's present to grandma and grandpa or something like that. So I thought they would they would be really fun just to have the girls paint. And yeah, so I picked up two of these. All right, and the next thing I picked up was this really cute giant diamond ring. Um, I love it. It's like a little decor piece. I think it's really cute. I'm sure that the Dollar Tree has had this one in the past. Um, but I thought it would be fun if you are going to make Valentine's baskets um, for your kids. Um, if you have little girls, I thought this would just kind of be fun to stick in there. Um, so yeah, I made sure to pick that one up. All right, and then I'm not going to go in any particular order, you guys. I, like I said, this is kind of a random haul, as is most my hauls. So I'm just going to grab from the pile I have here and just show you what I got. So. I finally decided to pick these up. Now, I know a lot of people were hauling them when they first hit the Dollar Tree, and I was like, eh, I don't want them, I don't really need them, and then they were kind of gone for a while, and then I found them again, and I was like, okay, I better just grab them before they're gone, because uh, they are really cute, you guys. So this is the key covers. This is the unicorn one. It's really cute, you just stick your little key inside this little slit here, and I don't know, I just love it. The Both of the unicorns are different. This one has pink hair, this one has purple hair, so you can tell they're a little bit different. And then I got the mermaid ones, and they are different as well. This one has the pink, and this one has the purple. So I finally grabbed them, just because um, I might put some on my keys, um, like my work key and my car key, I just thought that would be fun. So I grabbed them, I picked them up. And then I found these new cosmetic bags. Um, this one is like the pink iridescent. It says love with the little arrows. It's very cute. I really love this little cosmetic bag. It's really, it's a lot prettier in person. You would have to see it. So I grabbed that one. And then they also had this blue iridescent one. It's like a blue and green. And this one says peace again with the arrows. Very cute, very fun. 
I thought this would be really cute for my girls. Um, try to incorporate that in maybe their Valentine's gifts. I'm not exactly sure yet, but I picked those up. And then I found these amazing little heart key tags or key chains. Um, this one is like the goldish color and it shifts over to the silver. I really, really love these, you guys. I just think they're so much fun. So I grabbed these and I might be just taking this keychain part off. Um, this one matches perfectly with my oldest daughter. And then this one is another one they had. This is like the true mermaid sequence when it goes from like blues and greens to purples and pinks. I don't know if you guys can see that. I just love it. I think it's so cute. So I grabbed this one because Presley is the mermaid lover and yeah, so grabbed that one. Thought that was And fun. then um, I picked up these pencil grips because I couldn't pass them up, you guys. They are cute little teddy bear pencil grips and they come with green and just a bunch of different colors. You can see there, I just thought they were really cute. They look like little gummy bears. Super adorable. I picked those up for Brooklyn and school as long um, as well as Presley. Presley can use some at school as well. So I grabbed those for them. And then you guys, um, I'll just show you all of the Valentine's candy I got. So I went ahead and I got these Sweet Tart Hearts. Um, they are like the little conversation hearts, but they are Sweet Tarts. So the weird thing is, is like this year the Dollar Tree didn't get any like original OG candy hearts. Not candy hearts, sorry, conversation hearts. And so I thought that was a little weird. Um, I actually had to go to Walmart to get my conversational hearts, which is fine. They're only a dollar at Walmart. I just thought it was a little weird that the Dollar Tree didn't have any. But hey, these will do, and I love sweet tarts. So I grabbed a couple of these. Okay, sorry, I grabbed a few of these. And then I also grabbed these Smarties which are like the conversation hearts that you would usually get in the box. But instead, these ones are Smarties and they're actually not in the shape of a heart, they're circle, but they still have cute little sayings on them like true love, kiss me, best friend, be mine, all that cute stuff. So these are the love hearts um, and they are Smarties. So I picked up two packages of these. And then, um, I am going to be redoing my coffee bar and I thought these would be a good addition. So these are cinnamon imperials. Um, they're just little cinnamon bites. I thought these would be perfect. I love that they're red. So I grabbed a couple of these to throw into my coffee bar. And then I picked up some Russell Stover itty bitty hearts. So these are really cute. They're little chocolate hearts and it shows you a picture right here of one of the hearts and that is the actual size of it. So you don't get a whole lot in this package, you guys. Like the hearts start here and go down. Like this is nothing. So this is all the hearts you get in this package. I don't know if it's uh, worth a dollar, but I did want to see if I could incorporate these into my coffee bar as well. Um, if you wanted to make like a whole jar full of little chocolate hearts like this, you would need to probably buy a lot of these bags and I just don't know if it would be cost effective. So I only picked up two of these and then I may just mix them in with some of my chocolate chips, um, unless I can go to Walmart and find little candy hearts. So I only grabbed two of those. And then I found these adorable little baskets and these are perfect for me. So these are pink little baskets. They're in the shape of a heart and then on the side here, they have a bunch of little hearts. So I thought these were really cute. You, um, I'm gonna use these for my daughter's Valentine's baskets. And I'm just, you could weave like a ribbon through there, make it really cute and customize it. It is like a really pretty pink and the plastic has gold, or sorry, glitter on it. So, and it comes in a two pack, which is a great deal for a dollar. So I made sure to pick up these. All right, and then um, I don't know why I don't really, okay, so I used to be really into shabby chic. I used to really like the florals and the, um, like the old china and just really pretty things. And I'm not so much into like that anymore. You know, I used to have like this really pretty bird cage 
um, that was white and it had floral in it and it had a little bird and it was really it was shabby chic my decor used to be very shabby chic and now um, it's just not my thing but I couldn't pass up these stickers you guys they were really pretty and I think um, if you like shabby chic but you don't really incorporate it into your decor Valentine's Day is the best time of year to do that so I made sure to pick up these they have really pretty vintage looking um, images on them uh, with you know roses and these little birds just really pretty floral up here has a bird cage and it's just really pretty you guys I love these stickers I thought they were adorable and then they also had these ones which have like butterflies and some more floral I, if I hold it up too close I'm afraid you guys get a huge glare but that's what they look like very pretty I love those and then here are the other ones that I picked up as well so they're all a little bit different but they go along with the same theme so I made sure to get all of them but I would have to say that this one is definitely my my favorite so I made sure to grab those okay and then you guys I got a little um, hair tie hair accessory crazy like I went crazy with the hair accessory things but I could not pass up these amazing boxes so these are so cool if you've seen my what's new at Dollar Tree I showed you all of the different ones they had but these are like like headbands and it has a white one here and a pink one here and it has that like little crocheted um, headband and I either I might leave them like this or I might just take off these flowers and turn them into little hair clips but I got these ones right here I'm so sorry I got these ones right here and then I picked up these ones and these ones are really cool because they just have that headband with the little bows there's a white one and a, a dark pink one and then this light pink flower headband and then they had this one which isn't really my favorite but I do like these right here which are all these little bow um, clips with this white headband and the little blue and then they had some hair ties and then I picked the this one up this is a green one a pink one and then some more little hair ties now you guys this would be perfect it was in the baby section these would be perfect if you want to just put them in your stash pile as gifts for when you have a baby shower that comes up or anything like that or you can just you know do what I'm gonna do and take the little flowers and the bows off and make your own little hair clips if you have any little girls um, so yeah there's that I made sure to grab those I think they're a great deal for a dollar you guys and then just along with that I did get a bunch of hair bows so these are the Remington ones um, they have they come in pink and black and I love the Remington I just think it's fun when you find like name brand stuff at the Dollar Tree so I grabbed these ones this one is not a Remington brand, but I could not pass up on this adorable little, it's like um, a coral or a salmon, or I would say it's more coral. It's a really cute bow. So I grabbed that one. This is a Remington headband. It ha It's purple, and it has these really pretty flowers right here attached to the headband. I really like the color of this headband. So I made sure to pick that up. And I really like this black clip. It's a hair clip by Remington as well. Just, and it gives you, the cool thing is on the back, it gives you all these different ways that you can wear the headband. So that's really fun. I really like that. Um, it even says, you know, go ahead and clip it on your shirt. So there's an idea. And then this is also Remington. Um, it has some different bobby pins. There's black bobby pins and then gold bobby pins. Well, they're like more of a brownish bobby pin. But then I really like these, how they have the green and the blue. I thought those were really, really cute. So I grabbed those. And then I just really liked these. These are Anywhere Hair for hair and wrists. So they come with little hair ties and then also little bracelets. So there's that. I really thought those were cool. So you can wear a little hair tie and a little bracelet along with it. So I just thought that was fun. And we could all use some hair ties around here. We go through hair ties like crazy. Okay, and this one, this is just more for me because it's a new year. School just started. I feel like I have a lot going on. And so I'm going to be super busy. 
so I made sure to get these magnet, um, they're dry erase magnets, and this one says, don't forget to do, and then when I get to it, um, I don't know what that means, when I get to it, um, I don't know what you would write on that magnet. Um, I'm more of the don't forget and to do. Like I'm, I'm gonna be pretty busy here in the next couple of weeks, so I needed these. And then I also made sure to pick up some dry erase markers, so that, and I made sure to get the magnetic ones so that I can hang them on my fridge with my little don't forget and to do list. Because yeah, I, I need some. Reminder, so here shortly I am going to be super busy. Like I said, school just started. Um, I'm gonna keep posting. I might not be very consistent this semester. I'm gonna try my hardest to make sure you guys get a what's new at Dollar Tree on Tuesdays and then a Dollar Tree haul on Thursdays. I'm gonna try to fit in some more videos in between. I have some DIYs that I'd really like to get done and show you guys and all my Valentine's Day stuff is coming up. So. I'm just going to try to get really organized and get everything together so that I can make sure that I'm staying consistent and I'm bringing you guys videos that you like to see. So that's all I have for you guys today. Um, if you are Till Death Do Us Art 8, I think is what it is, please comment below. I would really like to send you these lace stickers and these Made With Love jars. Um, I know you might already have the jars, but I would be more than happy to send them to you anyway. So just let me know down below if you're interested in that. But that's all I have for you guys today. That is my Dollar Tree haul. If no one has told you they love you today, guys, I do. Bye. Have a good day.